This YouTube channel, it's straight up blowing up, hitting over 250k subs in just six months. And get this, they're banking some serious cash with a simple method that anyone can pull off. I'm talking about a solid $2,300 to $37,000 odd per month, like clockwork. And all they're doing? Uploading TikTok clips with a quick story voiceover. It's legit easy money, my friends. So, what's the secret sauce? It's all about blending viral ASMR clips with short stories. These bad boys are like gold mines for a faceless YouTube channel, pulling in those views and cash like nobody's business. Here's a clip of one of those videos so you know what I'm talking about. Dirty little Matt is sitting in the back of math class, obviously not paying any attention, when the teacher calls his name. Yeah, teacher? He replies, if there are three ducks on a- Today, I'm here to show you how to jump on this money train and make your own viral smash. This is too easy, man, so let me put you on game. Before we dive deep, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more money-making AI content. All right, let's get into it. To begin, let's dissect these viral shorts into content layers and get to the framework behind what makes these videos go viral in the first place. My secret slash not so secret anymore strategy is to divide the video up into content layers. Let me explain. Firstly, we're talking primary layers. The first primary layer is the ASMR video, visuals that captivate, drawing viewers in like moths to a flame, repurposing clips that are already viral and tapping into a trending niche. No need to reinvent the wheel. Next on the list is the viral short story. This is the meat and potatoes of the video, folks. We're talking about uncovering those untapped short stories that have already set the internet on fire elsewhere. The trick here, it's all about transforming text tales into captivating video narratives, complete with proof of concept, ensuring viewers stay hooked from start to finish. Now, on to the secondary layers. Here comes the voiceover with captions. Cue the AI-generated voiceovers to bring that story to life. Hyper-realistic narration here, bros, courtesy of Eleven Labs. Last but not least, the viral audio layer. We're talking about leveraging those trending sounds from the YouTube audio library. The algorithm loves them, so slap those babies on and watch your views skyrocket. When you blend all these ingredients together, you've got yourself a viral cocktail and a proven strategy to make money with a faceless YouTube channel. And guess what? I'm about to spill the beans on exactly how to whip up these bad boys in record time. Plus, I've got a sneaky little trick up my sleeve to target those niches with pinpoint accuracy, maximizing your channel's earning potential. I've whipped up a detailed step-by-step -step guide for y'all. You'll find the link in the description below. Trust me, having it handy will make following along a breeze. So, go ahead, open up my guide in a separate tab, and let's dive into the action. All right. Time to give your channel a killer name. We're not just brainstorming on our own here. We're tapping into the genius of ChatGPT. If you're not on this train yet, you're definitely missing a trick. Just toss a prompt its way, outlining your project idea and objective, and boom, you've got yourself some bussin' ideas in seconds. I'm telling you, AI is a game changer. We've got a bunch of options to pick from, but let's go with this gem right here. Quick tip, when naming your channel, think about your audience. Are they mostly dudes or ladies? What age group are we talking about? And hey, does your niche have any hot keywords you can slip in there? Give it some thought and optimize everything for maximum impact right from the get-go. Now that we've got our channel name sorted, it's time to head over to YouTube and set up shop. You probably know the drill, but stick around because I've got some branding and optimization tricks up my sleeve that'll make your channel pop. If you're the creative type, this part's gonna be a blast. If designing isn't your thing, no worries. I'll show you how to whip up some killer artwork like a seasoned pro using Canva. First things first, fire up Canva's web app or open it on your desktop. You can knock this up on both mobile and desktop, so no excuses. We're gonna craft both your logo and YouTube channel banner right here. Let me show you how. Let's get our logo game on. Open up a new project and select logo to get the right dimensions for our logo project. Then, over on the left, hit design. In the templates section, you can click on the logo tab or simply type logo into the search bar and hit enter. You've got a ton of options here, so take your time scrolling until you find a design that vibes with your channel's aesthetic, name, and audience. And don't stress if there are elements you want to tweak or add. I'll walk you through that real quick. 
Keep in mind that your logo is going to be shrunk down to thumbnail size or smaller in most cases. So, keep it simple, use bold fonts, and consider abbreviating long words to initials. This bad boy is going to be your brand mark, so let's make it count. Now that we've got our slick logo, let's keep the vibe rolling with the banner. Using the same font keeps our branding consistent and on point. Quick pro tip here. When you're uploading your banner to YouTube, you'll see this illustration showing you how it'll look on different devices. Trying to line up the text for every screen can be a real headache. So, to save you time and stress, pick a template on Canva where the text's already centered. Check out this one. Just change the font to match your branding, but don't mess with the size or placement, and you're golden. Now, the design should be clean and focused on one thing, getting those new visitors to hit that subscribe button. Feel free to choose a background image that reflects your content, and you can even tweak the opacity to increase text visibility, but that's optional. Once you've got your new logo and YouTube banner all dialed in, hit download. Then, head back over to YouTube Studio, hit the Customize tab, and upload your logo and banner. Boom! Just like that, our channel's got a catchy, optimized name, a cohesive logo, and a banner design that's luring our target audience to hit that subscribe button. Let's dive into the meat and potatoes of our content creation process. Finding that killer short story. There are a bunch of different techniques out there, like scavenging Reddit or Quora, but I've got something a little off the beaten path for you. To uncover short stories that haven't already been rinsed by other content creators, hop on over to Pinterest. There, you'll find a treasure trove of short stories with untapped viral potential. Now, here's the key, my friends. Every piece of content we source needs to have proven virality. What's that mean? It means the content's gotta have some serious street cred. We're not reinventing the wheel here. We're just taking content that's already gone viral and giving it a fresh spin. That's the secret sauce to winning big in this content creation game. All right, back to Pinterest. Once you've found a story you're vibing with, snap a quick screenshot on your device. Now, turning that image into a script for our voiceover might seem like a tedious task, but hey, that's where AI comes in clutch. Open up a new tab in your browser and type in image to text AI. Personally, I like using this site called OCR2 Edit. Just drag and drop your image into the box, and boom, AI does the heavy lifting for you. Now that we've got our script, give it a quick once over for any errors or typos. AI's pretty slick, but it's not infallible. Then, we fire up our go-to text-to-speech tool for those hyper-realistic AI voices, Eleven Labs. If you're not familiar with how powerful this voice generative AI is, hit up the link above for a deep dive tutorial. First things first, you gotta choose the right viral voice for your story. This part's crucial, believe me. The go-to voice for viral short stories that's got all the creators buzzing is none other than Adam. Just search for Adam in the voice library. Oh, and quick tip, make sure you snag the right one from the downloads. There's a few copies floating around. Once you've found Adam, play the one with the most downloads then hit add to library. Now that we've got our viral voice locked in, it's time to work some magic. Hit up speech synthesis, then copy and paste your story into the text box. Hit that generate button and make sure you're using the V2 model for the crispiest results. Oh, and keep that bass booster on for maximum quality. Boom, within a few seconds, our voiceover is good to go. Let's give it a listen. There was a girl named Becca and a boy named Joe. Becca was in a burning house. None of the firefighters could get in the house because the fire was too big. Joe dressed. Yup, sounds solid. Hit that download button and stash all these assets neatly in a folder. Now, onto the next content layer, the visual aspect. Time to sprinkle in those viral ASMR clips as the backdrop to our short stories. Let's hunt down those viral ASMR gems. And where better to find them than good old TikTok? Dive into TikTok and search for ASMR videos. Trust me, you're gonna stumble upon a ton of ASMR content here, enough to make you wonder what in the world you're watching. But hey, no need to overthink it. Just know it's crazy popular content, growing bigger by the year. Once you've found the perfect viral clip, it's time to give it a makeover. First step, removing that pesky watermark. Head over to SnapTik app. Don't worry, all the links are in the Google Doc you'll find in the description. Paste your TikTok link into the box, hit download, and voila. You've got yourself a watermark-free viral ASMR clip, all set for your short story. Now, let's bring all these layers together to create one epic viral optimized YouTube short. For this, I'm gonna roll with CapCut. 
but feel free to use any video editor that tickles your fancy. CapCut's my go-to. It's not just free, it's packed with some seriously dope AI tools that'll make your editing game strong. Fire up the desktop app or just Google CapCut and open the web app in your browser. Start a new project, then simply drag and drop your story voiceover from Eleven Labs and your ASMR clip from TikTok into the project. From here on out, we'll call these assets. Ready to rock and roll. Now that we've got our assets uploaded, let's set the stage with the right dimensions for YouTube Shorts. Hit that 16.9 button in the bottom right of the player window, then tweak the dimensions to 916. With the project set up, it's time to pull this all together. Drag and drop those assets onto the timeline like a boss. First up, let's mute the TikTok audio from the ASMR video. It's easy, just right click on the clip, hit extract audio, and bam, it's gone. If you wanna speed up or slow down the video clip to match your story vibe, just click on the clip, hit up the speed tab on the right panel, and tweak it using the slider. Smooth sailing. Here's a killer tip to level up your story voiceover and keep your audience hooked. We're gonna trim down those spaces between speech, making the narration fast and punchy. You know that snappy, almost overlapping vibe? Yeah, that's what we're aiming for. Zoom in on the timeline so you can see those spaces clear as day. Start at the beginning and work your way through each gap you find. Here's where the keyboard shortcut comes in handy. I'm talking about the split tool. On Mac, it's a sweet combo of Command and B. Just slide that bar across as you go, ensuring the audio clip is selected. You'll see that white border. Snip those silent spaces between speech, repeat the process till your video's as tight as can be. Let's spice things up with some captions. CapCut's got us covered. Just click on the text icon over here on the left. Then hit Captions, select English from the drop-down, and hit Generate. Give the AI a sec to do its magic, and voila, your captions appear on the timeline. But hold up, they're looking a bit plain and dry, aren't they? Let's fix them up for some serious virality with a single click. Select one of those caption boxes on the timeline, then head over to the right panel and click on Templates. We're talking about text effects that pop, so pick one that catches your eye. Center the text using the guides and resize if needed. Oh, and make sure to tick that Apply All button so you're not stuck doing this one by one. Now, for a few optional finishing touches. Wanna add a watermark to your videos? No stress. CapCut lets you do it with your logo or text, giving your content identity and boosting brand awareness. Then you can template it and apply it to all your future videos. Bam, done. And if your clip's low quality or gloomy, you can add clarity and brightness. I swear by the crystal clear filter for that extra pop. Head over to Filters, drag and drop the filter on your video clip, and bam, you'll see the enhancement right in the player window. It's like magic, isn't it? But hold up, what about the music? Sure, we could slap on some royalty-free tunes from CapCut, but we don't settle for 80% here, do we? For the best shot at going viral, we're gonna tap into YouTube's audio library. Why, you ask? Well, it's a well-known fact in the creator community that using native audio from YouTube's library boosts your video's chances with the algorithm. So let's make it happen. The only catch is, unfortunately, you can't access the Shorts audio library from desktop. This can only be done on the mobile app. So, to get around this, we'll need to move our video downloaded from CapCut to our mobile device. Now, there are multiple ways of doing this, depending on which device you're using. So, I'll give options for both Mac and Android users. If you're using a Mac and have an iPhone, then you know moving media around is as easy as an airdrop. Literally, just right-click on the video you want to send to your phone, click Share, then AirDrop. Make sure your phone is unlocked, and you'll see it pop up in Devices. Click the icon, Save to Photos, and you're done. Easy as pie. Android users, this is the easiest way without compromising the quality of the video. Just download the Google Drive app to your phone so you can access files from your mobile device. Then, from your desktop, upload your video into your Google Drive. Give the folder a name so it's easy to locate. Your video's chilling in Google's cloud, and you can download them at will using the Google Drive app on your phone. Now that we have our video on our mobile device, we can go ahead and upload it to YouTube. Here, we can access the audio library. All the trending music is listed here, so go through and choose music that suits your video, story, and the audience you're targeting. Before you post, make sure to edit the volume using the settings. Adjust the sliders to reduce the music lower than the voiceover. It's important that the voice is the primary sound and not overcast by the music. Choosing music with fewer drum patterns is best, as it sounds less cluttered. And just like that, our viral short is complete. 
But before we hit that publish button, let's take a there look. There was a girl named Becca and a boy named Joe. Becca was in a burning house. None of the firefighters could get in the house because the fire was too big. Joe dressed in one of the fire. Now, for the money earning potential. It's no cap that this simple strategy is clearly paying creators thousands each month, all for just a couple of hours of work each week. And this is just one of many faceless methods to make money on YouTube using AI. If you're sleeping on all these AI money-making methods, it's time to wake up. There's a gold rush happening, and it's as easy as what I've just shown you to become a part of it. So here's what to do next. Subscribe to my channel so you're always in the loop with the latest methods and guided through the process. Then hit the link in the description of this video that will take you to my step-by-step -step guide of how to create viral shorts just like these. Fast track your YouTube monetization so you can start earning within a couple of months. All the links for every tool or website you need are included so there's no time wasted. Everything I've shared with you is entirely free with zero risk and hella reward. Congratulations for making it to the end of the video. Now just take that final actionable step and we can all grow together as a community.